I understood that understanding people. One of the most powerful things you can do is be able to learn how to communicate with others and learn what they're communicating to you. You also must understand how incredibly hard it is to get a business going. It's going to be tough. It's not going to be all sunshine and rainbows. You're going to have to take zero days off for a long time. You're going to have to put in the work when everybody else is out partying and having a good time. And you're going to have to focus, sit down, and get to the nitty gritty. So many people out there nowadays are talking about how things should change, yet they aren't doing anything to change what they want changed. However, right now, we're in a very unique spot in the world where the things that we complain about on a day-to-day -day basis are, actu are actually such a minute detail in our day, which goes to show how much growth we've had as a species. It's all about having that drive, and it's really important to have a good crew with you of people that put work into you and you put work into them that you know when stuff hits the fan they'll be there for you and you can do whatever it takes to help them out and you'll get that exact return whenever you need it and wherever you are and you're always going to need to stay hungry and stay vigilant always stay on top of what you want to do so that way you can achieve your wildest dreams i've spent a career trying to figure out what we say versus what i think is eventually going to happen and then i bet my energy On a very serious note, forget about the context of that word. I think it was around the time I turned 30 that I understood that understanding people um, and consumer behavior was something that I had and that there was a way to deploy it against something besides selling more wine. And so I'm not comfortable with the word genius, Steph, but this singular thing that I think will allow me to create a lot of success in my life is predicated on emotional intelligence. Started to understand it a little bit more in my early 30s. I think that we're living through a period of time right now between Shark Tank, between you know the social network, the movie, that people are confused and think that it's just so easy to build a business where you make a million dollars a year. The top 1% earners in America make $400,000 a year, right? Like, we are not grounded in any level of practice.